I'm gonna feel the size of that boba ball in my mouth. <laughs> People know me as like the crazy boba girl, so I was gifted this beautiful suck my balls boba shirt. I love boba, but I don't love boba, if that makes sense. What? People say like, oh, I have to go for my daily Starbucks run. I'm like, no, I need my daily boba run, right? I'm not someone who's super, super into chewing my drinks, but maybe my mind will change today. I love boba. My go-to flavor though is a classic. I like the milk tea boba. I really love the, uh, the fresh tastes of it mixed with the sweetness, the milkiness. If you get the right consistency of balls, then it's delicious. Bring on the first boba! This is a classic milk tea. Cheers. Cheers. I feel like the flavors go together. It's just a little bit more on the sweet side. You can taste the tea. The balls. They're like a bit gloopy yeah, on the outside, kind of, yeah. right? Yeah. Like they're not super firm. The inside's a little bit firm, but yeah. the outside's kind of mm. gloopier maybe than, than I would usually really enjoy. I would say this is pretty good. It kind of tastes like gongcha a little bit. A little bit. Right? I love the creaminess with, with the milk in there. Mm -hmm. It's got a nice rounded flavor to it. They really got slimy with the uh, outside. If I was really craving boba and this was by my house, I would probably stop by and be like, okay, cool. Boba time. I mean, okay, already looking at it, does it look a little These, rock harder? No, they look softer. Oh. Cheers! Damn. The tea actually tastes a little bit chocolatey and creamy. This is definitely more of like a creamy, kind of milkier tea for sure. It tastes a little like honey. Maybe it's sweeter than the other one as well. It's sweeter than the other one in not a good way. I will agree with you in the sense that the boba does have a nice texture, but the tea is so off. The boba is also much smaller. The boba's smaller, it's more subtle. I think a little less chewy, too. What happens is that it gets stuck in the straw, and then you have to like suck really hard, and then it all comes out at once. This is boba and tea that would get divorced. Oh, it's gongcha! She's fancy. Like, okay, she's also much lighter. This will be the most milky, I'm assuming. So gongcha is what I know as like the, the best chain to be drinking from in Los Angeles right now. Of the three so far, this is definitely the strongest. Good quality tea leaves, good quality milk, great boba, happy girl. It's such a subtle tea flavor. How do you feel about the boba? This boba is much more chewy, I think. They're not too big and they have that chewiness, almost like an al dente sort of uh, pasta situation, you know? <laughs> Let's get it on. Let's do it. I taste the tea. This is definitely Mr. Boba. Oh no, maybe I was wrong. I think that this is Boba time. Boba time. I'm gonna say that this is Mr. Boba. Yeah, it is, it is. Because the tea is there. I can taste it's the tea. Strong. And the tea aftertaste That's is That's why I'm thinking it's Mr. Boba. It's Boba time. You're wrong, I'm sorry my friend. I'm gonna feel the size of that Boba ball in my mouth. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I think this is boba time. I think you might be right, but I'm gonna have to go with Mr. Boba. This is boba time. I think this one is boba time. It can't be gancha. No, that would be no, no. crazy. I can tell that this tea doesn't have that chocolatey taste that you were talking about earlier about boba time. So this one has to be Mr. Boba. Boba time has much smaller These ones balls. are bigger. Okay, I'm gonna say this is Mr. Boba. I take it back. I say the other one is boba time. Okay. I think it's Mr. Boba. Mr. Boba? I think so, just because the boba, I remember the boba being clumpier. I'm gonna go with Mr. Boba. This is boba time. First one we had was Mr. Boba. I base it on the ball. <laughs> I'm gonna guess that this is the gongcha. Gongcha, yeah. I'm gonna go with gongcha. I'm gonna go with gongcha. I'm gonna second that, yeah, uh, I think so. Oh, this is gongcha. It's definitely, yeah. I am the queen! Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought I knew what I was talking about. It's a holistic experience. It's true, it's because true. I really do pay attention to the boba ball. <laughs> oh, did I do it? Yeah! 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 I feel so validated. Still on the throne. <laughs> I would like to thank my mom. Maybe I should have switched my, my game plan here and gone more the boba route than the tea route. But that's just because what I know is tea. That's so interesting to see 
how, how much harder it is to, to tell the difference as soon as you're only relying on your sense of taste. I would say it takes a few times to get used to eating the tapioca ball. A lot of people don't like it first time they try it, but I would say it really grows on people. Mm. Mm. Oh, so good.